with an incredible meatball soup using the Trader Joe's vegetable hash and it was incredible. I have some beef and I have homemade beef broth. I'm not going to use all the oil. I'll throw it out. I am going to season the beef just with salt, pepper, and some garlic and nothing else. I don't want to add onions to it. I don't want to add a lot of flavors in it. I wanted to keep it super simple and delicious and very light and brothy. I know this has meat in it, but the soup is incredibly light it doesn't feel heavy at all and we're going to trim a lot of the fat away we're going to roll them into tiny meatballs tiny bowls just like that and cook them in its own oil the oil from the meat from the broth that i made earlier the broth i just made using salt and short ribs from beef i also love adding some turmeric it gives beautiful color to all the soups i am going to collect the meat after it is mostly cooked because you're going to boil it anyway with the vegetables and i'm going to get rid of 95 percent of this oil that is unnecessary we don't need it and then leave the little bit of oil in it and return the vegetables or add the vegetables into the pot and cook them until they're all soft and beautiful and become aromatic from the onion and from the herbs. And then I'm going to just season it with salt and pepper. And then you can always add additional seasonings. I added the cha the chili lime seasoning into this and you can add some cumin some bay leaves anything your heart desires i love bay leaves in my soups i added a little bit of dry thyme it's just all up to you what you want to season your soup with i really wanted to make the soup gluten free but you can go ahead and add one fourth a cup of rice into it to make it really thick my soup was very very soft and and loose and had a lot of liquid but if you want it thicker just add a little bit of rice when you add the broth and let everything cook and you can just cook it until the rice is cooked but again i wanted to keep it super gluten free and i trimmed the fat one more time and cooked it for a little bit until it looked just like this and it was incredible i hope you make it and you enjoy thanks for watching